Warner Brothers Pictures has set Christopher Nolan's 2008 superhero sequel, The Dark Knight, for a re-release in four select IMAX theaters to celebrate the film's 10th anniversary. Venues in Los Angeles, New York, San Francisco and Toronto will host the film for a limited one-week engagement beginning August 24, reports Variety.com. Nolan and Oscar-winning cinematographer Wally Pfister pioneered the use of IMAX 70mm photography and feature filmmaking on the production, marking The Dark Knight as the first major feature to utilize IMAX cameras. Nolan had previously tested the possibilities of the format's massive scale and increased resolution with an IMAX digital remastering of Batman Begins, in the years since, movies such as, Transformers, Revenge of the Fallen, Mission, Impossible, Ghost Protocol, Star Trek Into Darkness, and Star Wars, The Force Awakens, have followed suit, not to mention Nolan's own, The Dark Knight Rises. Interstellar, and Dunkirk, Damien Chazelle's First Man, and Patty Jenkins' Wonder Woman 1984, are among upcoming releases continuing in their wake. Released on July 18, 2008, The Dark Knight became, at the time, just the fourth film to ever cross the $1 billion mark at the worldwide box office. It scored north of $533 million. Stateside and still sits in the all-time domestic top 10, the film was nominated for eight Academy Awards and won two, including a posthumous supporting actor Oscar for Heath Ledger's memorable performance as the Joker.